When we follow Jesus Christ, it's very important that we bear good fruit. Uh, it's very important also that people can see on us that we bear good fruit. Uh, so uh, I, I have uh, started to rebuke people on Facebook, for example, because Facebook is our face out. Uh, because dear people, uh, many people will see, uh, see us. Uh, and uh, it's very important, therefore, that we have a clean Facebook page, uh, free from all uh, ungodly uh, stuff like wicked movies and video games and ungodly music. Uh, we have to make sure our, our uh, page is for Jesus Christ only and uh, not also uh, for demons. So uh, I, I have uh, seen two different kinds of uh, Christians uh, I have rebuked. One type is lukewarm Christians. That type is when I have seen that those people have ungodly stuff on their pages, they even got angry on me and said, don't judge me. And I judge righteously because I don't live in sin anymore. I don't take part of ungodly stuff. So I have the right to judge those people who do. So it, it's a righteous judgment. Uh, but they, they, they call me names and say it's wrong and uh, yesterday one told me that I had demons just because I told him to stop uh, like wicked movies with violence and stuff. So it's many lukewarm Christians that get angry on me when I rebuke them, uh, when I say that they, it's important that they uh, take away all ungodly stuff from their lives. Uh, so those people need to repent and get serious about Jesus Christ, but it's also another part of Christians, true Christians, that I have rebuked, uh, true brothers and sisters in Christ, uh, that, that I, I understand that they are true Christians, and they have happily, they have uh, accepted my rebuke, they have listened on what I said, and they have get rid of the ungodly stuff on the Facebook page. And you know what? That's because they love Jesus Christ. They understand that if we follow Jesus Christ, they can't have uh, un ungodly stuff on their pages. So they love Jesus Christ so much that so they listened on what I said and they got rid of it from the pages. Uh, I think that everyone should, should uh, take a look on the Facebook page more often to see that uh, so that the, it's look clean. So I just wanted to do this video to tell everyone out there that uh, if you follow Jesus Christ, make sure to bear good fruit and make sure that people can see that on you. Uh, it will come automatically when we follow Jesus Christ. People will see that we bear good fruit. But like I said, old stuff, wicked stuff and things like that on Facebook stuff uh, and things like that. It's uh, our own duty to get rid of old stuff like that. And I also want to say that uh, if you own old wicked movies or video games or music, uh, wicked music, uh, get rid of it. Uh, if you own uh, clothes uh, with maybe uh, uh, pictures on it, like skulls or whatever it is, get rid of it. Get rid of every ungodly stuff in your life. Jesus Christ don't want you to bear a, a skull on your clothes or, or, or own a, a movie like Scarface or whatever it is. He don't, he don't want you to, to do that. He wants you to get rid of all this uh, bad stuff and just live for him. So uh, make sure that you do this if you love Jesus Christ. God bless you.